Hi everyone, this is Charles from Harvard USA. In this video, I will introduce you to Qt Creative to develop application that can be run in the Hyo Yocto Embedded device. The device I'm gonna be using is the Hyo Starter Kit and I have the Yocto X11 image installed. The main component to develop Qt application is to get the software development kit. We can get it by BigBay the Qt5 Meta toolchain. There's a lot of compiler to choose from the SDK. Right here, I'm using the ARM Pocket Linux Maybe G++. For Qt versions, the SDK comes with version 5.2.1 for embedded Linux. After that, I can put everything together to get a kit that can compile applications specifically to the Hyo Yocto device. I also use Qt to connect to my device remotely by setting up the IP, username, and password. To demonstrate, I will create a simple Hello World project. So let's click on New Project. I will use the console applications, create, and type in hello world. I'll choose the kit that I've just created, the Hyo kit, and no version control. In main, I will include the IO stream the standard library using name space std and I'll make sure that the terminal will output hello world also in the Qt project file I will set up the install path so that Qt know where to put the deploy file. So target.path equals to the destination of my Hyo device, and I'll install the path. Finally, I can run the applications, and it will say hello world. In my device, I can click on terminal. And then if I go to my home folder, I can see that Qt has transferred the deploy file, hello world. I can execute hello world, and it will say hello world. For more information on how to set up Qt Creator for Yocto embedded device, you can go to hioproject.org. Thank you for watching.